Hi guys, it's the self-taught gymnast, and my sister is supposed to make this video with me, but, you know, <laughs> duties call, you know, like school and homework and stuff, I already finished away, so I'm going to start off with the, our, my channel, our channel, by making a introduction video but i'm sure in the next video my sister will be in the next video and perhaps possibly my brother in the video after that but that's all and i'm gonna show you an idea because like i don't want this video to be short so i'm gonna show you an idea that i think is like a life hack for people who is potential gymnast or real gymnast so either you'll need like a diary or you'll need like a regular notebook um this is what my notebook looks like or you need like a binder with a lot of paper or whatever you use it could be any paper because i know some people don't have those kind of things so um what you will need is a notebook or whatever you would like to use and you feel comfortable that nobody will really touch. Like, if you think it's school, like, if somebody will confuse this for school-related, then you should probably use this. But what you're going to do is take this and you're going to, if you want, and if you choose, put the date up here. And it's three, it's February, um... It is March 2nd, 2016, and it is Wednesday. Um, in parentheses here, I have only complete 10 per skills, because, like, I'll explain. So, when I tell you what the 10 list that I am working on, it does not mean that I don't know it, because I do know it, but it's just, like... I would like to continue building up because I would like to be able to do an oversplit and not and like go all the way down. I like to do a handstand and hold it for at least two minutes, you know. So like that. So number one is to complete ten bridges. Number two is to complete ten back bends on bed because that's how I stretch my um, back before like I do a back bend on the floor. Number three is a back bend either on our low bed or on the floor because sometimes I might get a cramp in my back like after doing five of them because like when I do it I go down and go automatically up and sometimes like I do I like I almost fall so. Yeah, and then a back bend kick over on wall because, or, I mean, a bridge kick over on wall because I would get into a bridge and then I like put one leg up for a kick over and then from the wall I would like get off of it. But I'll like show you it when I have my um back bend kick over like completely because all I'm working on is a kick over I already have the back bend and stuff so I just need to work on the kick over then I'll make a tutorial on how to do that I'm working on my front walk over too so I just need like I already know how to like do the front walk over but I just don't know how to stand up in time so that's just all so I'll also do a tutorial on that soon too so number four is the bridge kick over on wall but I already just told you about that. Number five is kick over stretches because, like, I watched this video and they had really cool stretches. So I was like, ooh, I got to try that. So once again, that will be in the video too. Um, number six is forward rolls. I know how to do that. Seven backward rolls. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Um, eight handstand. I do know how to do it. Nine candlestick. Easiest thing in the world. For some people. And number ten is splits. So after I do that, after I complete them all, down here I list my breakfast, my lunch, snack, and or dinner. We, I mean, dessert. Because I know some people have snack and dessert, but we only have healthy snacks. Because, like... 
we're learning proportionality or something like that proportion for food so we like have an apple for snack we don't get dessert unless it's somebody's birthday but we don't really mind it because like our dinner is healthy and filling but yep yeah. and dinner so like i didn't write down what i ate yet but i will be soon so like maybe like after i'm done with this video i'll do it but yeah that's all so this is the sister that i was talking about she will be making videos with me in our next video we will probably do my gymnastic skills and then the video after my gymnastic skills will be her gymnastic skills so what we're basically what basically the video is going to be about is like she'll tell me what to do and then i'll do it I'll, or i'll try to do it and then i'll tell her what to do and she'll try to do it but like i won't force her to do certain things because i know she doesn't do it so if you have anything to say say hi hi comment and subscribe down below bye no, it's like, comment down below and subscribe. She always, you she always say like, like, comment and subscribe down below. So, yeah. Bye.